So, good morning! I'm going to university today. I don't have any classes, but I have an appointment with my professor to talk about my thesis topic. I am really excited and a little bit nervous because I don't know which topic I'm gonna get. I don't know if he has some kind of an idea in his mind. Maybe he has already a topic for me. And my plan is to show you my university today. I really want to show you the way that I take to the university with my bike and I want to show you the cafeteria, the library, how the university looks, the campus. Of course the weather is not the best. I mean today it's a little bit sunny-ish and most of the time it's cloudy. The sky looks very black but sometimes it's sunny so let's try our chance the good thing is it's not raining today which is so unlikely for Germany it's most of the time raining here in winter so as I said I'm gonna take my bike today it's gonna be a little bit difficult to hold the phone and record my way to go to university but I will try my best I hope that I don't fall down or break my head or break my teeth or if a police sees me i don't get a fine or something <laughs> yeah i will i will try my best and at the university it's gonna be a little bit difficult for me because i'm kind of shy <laughs> if i have to record something holding the phone like this all the time but uh, yeah i'm sure that some of you really want to see the university life here or some of you, you are going to study in Eustace Liebig University of Gießen and you want to know how the university looks like. So I'm gonna record it for you guys. All right, so if you are ready, let's go. Here I am, almost entering the university. The sun is shining so nice. And today is not so cold as it was before. So it's gonna be a nice day, hopefully. <laughs> I'm in the elevator and wish me luck! Right, so we are on the fourth floor of B1 building and here you can see the classroom numbers and then yeah when you enter you will see some brochures or some um, posters about conferences and news about the university or our department and on the other side we have some more classrooms yes when you enter you will see some flyers some uh, trash bins and offices of the professors here um, you see the classroom and on the left side there is an office of a professor and you see a really helpful sign there which shows if the professor is there or not and sometimes you can see results of researches that were done before on the walls. And now we are going to the third floor, which also belongs to the English department. There are also classes and uh, professors' rooms. On this table here, you can always find some stuff to take away with you, some flyers, brochures, and even sometimes some books. 
Here we have some more information about the department, events going on. And on the third floor we have the library of the English department. And here is the room of Professor Olsen who is the head of the department. And we see some more news and events going on here. And now we are going to the cafeteria. And we go to Cool Bar, which is the cafeteria of the university. And next to Cool Bar, you can see the exhibition room. This is an exhibition that I also took part in. It's about scrapbooks from Victorian era. Here is one of my favorite ones. And this one that you see here is a scrapbook that my group worked on. And our scrapbook was very colorful as you can see it. And now we are going to the library. Here we have some lockers to save your stuff. With this machine you fill your semester card with some money to print out some stuff or copy. Here you put your chip card, then you can pay with card or with cash. You can also change the language to English, French, Italian and German. And here this is how you lock your stuff, basically just with your semester ticket. It's safely locked and to unlock you push it against the lock again. Here we are in the library now. You see some scanners and these are the printers. And there are always some tables in front of windows with a really nice scenery. And on the screen you can see workshops and some more news about the university. So now we are walking in the campus. All the buildings are named with letters and numbers. For example, B1, B2, C, C1, C2. And here is the parking lot. And this F1 building is for psychology department. Alright, so now we have next bike, which is very useful for students who don't have a bike. For the students of Justus Liebig University, they can always rent the bikes 20 minutes for free. And to register, it's also for free. According to the myth, if you go under the statue, you will fail from your studies or at least prolong one more year. Now we are at the Mensa. Here you can see the menu of today and the prices. And you can see where you can take these meals from. There are different entrances. Entrance 1, 2, 3, 4. For different sections. For example, for meat, for pasta, for salad. These are different. Here you can fill in your semester ticket with some money that you can spend in Mensa or cafeteria. Also on the first floor we have a bike store where you can pump your wheels for free. And outside there are some more tables where you can eat your meal. I just finished talking with my professor and he doesn't have a topic for me. I suggested some topics and he said that I have to do some more research and then talk with them again and specify my topic and everything. In the end, I don't have anything in my hands. Oh, sorry for not holding the camera properly. Right now I'm on the way to blood donation. Let's see if I can donate today. I just pumped up the wheels of my bicycle and uh, yeah, I'm going. I'm a little bit disappointed because I just really hope that my professor would have some kind of a topic for me but in the end he doesn't have anything so it's all up to me I mean this is also nice but it means that I have to work a lot first I have to read 
enough articles to come up with a topic, something interesting, something that is not done before or not researched so much. Yeah. And right now it just started raining a little bit. And also I'm taking another road back to home. So, hello again, just came home and looks like I have to do a lot of research just to find a topic and yeah, <laughs> love my life. <laughs> now it looks like I have to do two weeks of research and then he said that I should come up with two topics or three and then we will choose together. <sighs> Let's see. All right, then I'm going to make myself some tea and I'll start studying. I hope you enjoyed the video and tell me in the comments what you would like to see in the future videos or if you liked something or disliked something in my video, please tell me in the comments so I know what to do next. <laughs> All right, love you, bye bye.